The following video will contain some very delicious food, so you may not want to watch an empty stomach. Hey everyone, Scott or the Scott Man, and we are here in downtown Detroit, uh, not far from Campus Marshes Park along Michigan Avenue. We're here to do a Trail of the Lights video here at Lafayette Coney Island. It is one of legendary Coney Islands here in Detroit. Look across the street. We'll get this side of the camera really quick. We got two rival Coney Islands right next to each other. You got American Coney Island and you got Lafayette Co Coney Island, and we're going to be covering Lafayette Coney Island today because, uh, matter of fact, I was asked by someone to, to, to head there and I, I've always wanted to go to both Coney Islands, so it's like, why not? We'll, we'll, we'll go to both eventually, but I'm going to go to Lafayette today, see what their Coney dogs are all about. Should be, should be good stuff and then yeah, I'll, I'll go to, I'll go to the American maybe a, a, next time I'm down here. But yeah, Coney Islands are a staple of Detroit cuisine. You cannot go anywhere in Detroit or even Metro Detroit without seeing any Coney Island, whether it's Lafayette, American, or even like the some of the more localized chains such as Leo's Coney Island or National Coney Island. So what right here in Detroit you have to have a Coney dog at least once. So we're gonna cross over Michigan Avenue and we're gonna go enjoy some Coney dogs. Let's go. Alright, we're here inside and got a lot of people here already, but of course same time we got Oh, Detroit, Detroit Tigers game's on in a couple hours at Comerica Park, but... Got a nice little eating area. We've got two entrances over there and then over that way. We've got even the kitchen area over there. And we got the Coney Dogs, or Coney Islands. A Detroit-style hot dog, or Coney Island. It's a hot dog with chili, onions, and mustard. And I can smell the mustard. Wow. I think for some bites on camera, we're gonna grab the one from the right. That one looks less messy. All right. Just look at this. When you're in Detroit, you have to have a Coney Island. Hot dogs are nice, nice and juicy, nice and hot. Didn't get enough of the chili in that bite, so I'm gonna take another. Mm. Oh, this chili is so good. It has some great spices in it. Oh, this is a Coney dog, my friends. Mm. Oh, I love the chili in this. This is awesome. Probably said awesome so many times. But yeah. There we go. Maybe some more of these. Okay, one more bite on camera. This is too irresistible. Oh yeah. It's so awesome. All right, eat the rest of this off camera, hey, and I'll see you back outside. Oh man, those were so so delicious. Coney Islands are absolutely fantastic. Again, it's like yeah, you must try a Coney Island while you're here in, in Detroit. Uh, yeah, really enjoyed the Coney Dogs over at uh, Lafayette Coney Island and as I was saying at the beginning of the video I do want to go to American Coney Island on another day and do a travel the lights video there as well do a little bit of, of, of a comparison and we'll see if it's if it's like Zenders in the uh, Bavarian Inn with their chicken dinners with with uh, American and Lafayette being with their Coney Dogs 
But nevertheless, it was so amazing in there. Was great, great foods. In fact, their hours are pretty flexible. They're not tw they're not twenty four seven, at least not according to, to the menu that I was saying. But they're they're open late into the night though. So whether you're here for a for a sporting event like the Tigers, the, the Lions, the Red Wings, the Pistons, or if you're Want to get like a midnight snack? Why not get a Coney Dog here in downtown Detroit? As a matter of fact, yeah, I'm on the other side. As I was showing you, there are two entrances into, well, in fact, both Coney Islands. But we're talking about uh, Lafayette Coney Island in this video. So you can also go in off, off of Lafayette as well. And of course, the, and they got the main entrance over on Michigan Avenue. And if you're looking for parking, you can, there's some metered parking on the street, or you can even park over at the Financial District Garage. And as of early 2019, I do need a credit card to park in here. It's like, especially on the weekends, it's a fly rate of $10 unless there's a, a posted event. And then and also after 4 p.m. on weekdays, $10. And then during the weekdays before 4 p.m., it's $4 every 20 minutes, and but you can't go higher than $25. So there's plenty of parking opportunities here to check out not just Lafayette Coney Island, but even just to walk over to Campus Marshes Park. So if those Coney Dogs looked absolutely delicious, anyone want to watch more of my Trail of the Lights videos, uh, click on this video link to watch another Trail of the Lights video. In addition, uh, click on the subscribe button to, to come along for the adventure, cover many different cool travel vlogs, and also check out many cool restaurants along the way. Uh, thank you for watching today's Trail of the Lights video here at Lafayette Coney Island here in Detroit, Michigan. And this is Scott, or the Scott Man, signing out.